If you want to check all your traffic stats on your site dashboard, you need to integrate your Google Analytics code into the plugin. If you already have a Google Analytics account, go to 122 to learn how to integrate it into your website. If you don't have a Google Analytics account, you can easily create one on the Google Analytics website for free. I will show you how to do it right now. 1. How to create a Google Analytics account. Go to the Google Marketing Platforms page to access Google Analytics. Find the link in the description. If you have a Google account and are not signed in, click Sign in to Analytics. If you do not have a Google account, choose Get Started Today. Click Start Measuring. Type in your account name, you can use your domain name for that, and click Next. Type in your property name, you can also use your domain name for that, and click Show Advanced Options. Enable Create a Universal Analytics Property. Type in your website URL. Click the Create a Universal Analytics Property Only Radio button, and then click Next. Fill in your business information. Click Create. You'll go to the Google Analytics Terms of Service Agreement section. Make sure that the boxes are ticked. Click I accept. Choose the types of notifications. If a pop-up window appears, click the Save button. 2. How to integrate Google Analytics into your website. Sign in to your Google Analytics account. Click Admin. Tracking info. Tracking code. Copy the global site tag script. Go to your site WordPress dashboard. Customization. Head. CSS and scripts customization, and paste the copied script in the head tag container for head elements field. Click save settings. Then save all settings. 3. How to make Google Analytics live stats visible on your dashboard. Go to the Google Developers Console. Find the link in the description. Select your country and accept terms of service. Click Agree and Continue. In the dashboard, click the Create Project button. Or click Select a Project. New Project. In the Google Developers Console. Enter your project name. Click the Create button. Go to Dashboard. Click the Enable APIs and Services. Scroll down to Section Other. Click Google Analytics API. Then click Enable. Go to the Credentials tab. Click the Configure Consent Screen button. Choose the external user type. Click Create. In App Information, enter your app name and user support email. In Authorized Domains, click the Add Domain button and enter your domain name. In Developer Contact Information, enter your contact email address and click Save and Continue. Also click Save and Continue in the next two steps, Scopes and Test Users. In summary, click back to dashboard. Click Publish App. In the pop-up window, click Confirm. Click Credentials. Then Create Credentials. Select the OAuth Client ID option. In Application Type, select Web Application. And enter name. In Authorized JavaScript Origins, click Add URI and enter your domain name in UR as 1. In Authorized Redirect URIs, click Add URI, and paste the link to your site's traffic report. Click the Create button. Your client ID and your client secret will be displayed to you. Copy this information and paste it in your WordPress admin area. Go to Ali Dropship. Reports. Traffic Report. Click Continue. Click Get Access Code. If you see this screen, click Advanced. And then click the Go To button with the name of your app on it. Now you can choose an account to continue with. Click Allow in the Grant Traffic Permission window. After closing this window, click the Allow button again. Copy the access code and paste it in the WordPress admin area. Click Continue. Click Continue again. Now you can view your traffic report inside your WordPress dashboard. It might take Google Analytics some time before showing your stats. Don't worry if you don't see it immediately, it normally appears within a day or after a few hours. Update your site later and you will see your statistics. That's it.
If you need more information about the extension or Ali Dropship plugin please visit the Knowledge Base section on our official site.